What is going on internet? My name is Lou and I make Linux videos. So today I thought I'd bring you guys a sneak peek at a project I'm working on here and that's basically a fresh build of elementary OS ISIS. Now for those of you that are familiar with the elementary project, um, the elementary team has developed their own operating system based off of Ubuntu. The next version will be called ISIS. It'll be based off of Ubuntu 14.04, which is a long-term support release. Now, if you're anything like me, you like to try uh, bleeding edge software. However, uh, the elementary team has a quote unquote, when it's ready release philosophy, which means that um, you're gonna be um, kind of surprised as to when betas are gonna be out as well as the final release. Uh, they don't have a release schedule such as Ubuntu, which is a six month release schedule. So uh, if you're kind of chomping at the bit and you want to try out uh, the latest release from elementary, um, you're kind of out of luck. Now there are a few sources online that will give you uh, the option to download and install. However, if you're anything like me, unless it's coming from the official project, uh, you know, stuff like that kind of makes you nervous. So I went ahead and actually put this build together myself using the elementary uh, build system that they have available. Uh, you can see here that it is um, version 0.3 ISIS. It is 64-bit only. So I've decided to make this available for download to anybody who wants to try it. So you know, if you guys <clears throat> feel as though I'm a trustworthy source, by all means, you can uh, download and give this a spin. Now, for all the hippie haters out there that I got a lot of flack from on my last video from the Frankenstein build, uh, this is built um, using Elementary's own build system. It pulled all the packages from Ubuntu 14.04 and pulled down all of the source code from uh, the Launchpad repository. So um, this right here is an, an unstable build. It is not an official build. Okay, so please do not report any bugs that you find uh, here in this release because it is not supported by the Elementary team. This is development code is considered alpha software um, and non-official. So hopefully all of those disclosures satisfy everybody out there. Um, by all means, you do not have to try this. I just figured I'd put this together. And uh, for those of you that really wanted to get your hands on it, uh, you can try it. And as far as, my, uh, as far as I'm concerned, this is one of the beauties of open source software, the fact that you can go out, get your hands on it, compile it, and run it. Um, that's one of the beauties of, of running Linux. You know, I got a lot of flack the last video of putting my Frankenstein build together, but quite honestly, everyone, you know, if, if in terms of software freedom, I mean, the fact that we have an unproprietary, you know, uh, operating system here is awesome. Why not let as many people get their hands on it as possible? Um, and quite frankly, I believe this is a polished product and anyone actually trying it, um, all you're really going to do is build excitement and anticipation for the final release and increase your user base. Uh, you could argue that people would get frustrated with bugs um, and it may in turn cause somewhat of a negative um, perception. However, if, if you've got <laughs> two brain cells in any common sense, if you're using alpha software, unstable software, you're going to um, come to this whole project with the idea that it's going to be somewhat un unstable and it's not indicative of a final release. Okay, so with all those disclaimers out there, for all you hippie haters, um, there you go. You know, this is an unstable build, not from the elementary team. Please do not report bugs. Uh, but if you want to give it a whirl, uh, I hope that my efforts here, um, you know, help you guys out and give you an opportunity to try ISIS. This is not going to be a review video. I'm not going to go over all the new features and so on. I will probably be doing a separate video on that. Um, in the video description below, you will find a download link. It is almost one gig. So um, be prepared, depending on your connection, to uh, be waiting a little while. However, I am testing this on hardware uh, and it is fully working. Everything booted just fine. Um, it's a uh, build as of June 1st, so essentially you may only have a few updates between the time you install, if you install soon, um, and now, because all the packages and code were per completely up to date as of June 1st. So uh, once again, I'll be doing a review video on the development phases of ISIS, uh, some new features, and uh, so on and so forth. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Check the video description for a download link. And uh, by all means, you know, post a comment if you install it. Uh, let me know if it installs well and your thoughts. All right, guys, hopefully this video finds you well. And until next time, we'll talk to you guys later.